A karyotype is an individual's set of chromosomes. The term also refers to a laboratory-produced image of a person's chromosomes, arranged according to well-defined criteria. The first step in performing a karyotype is to collect a sample. A blood sample containing red blood cells, white blood cells, platelets, and plasma. The second step is separating the cells, a karyotype will be done on the white blood cells since they actively divide, and contain a nucleus where the chromosomes are located. The third step is growing cells, in order to have enough cells to analyze, the dividing cells are grown in a special medium at 37 degrees Celsius. This process of culturing can take 3 to 4 days. The fourth step is blocking cell division. The cells are treated with a chemical substance called colchicine, which blocks cell division in metaphase where the chromosomes are in their most compact form, and consequently, they are easily observed under a microscope. The fifth step is releasing the chromosomes from their cells, in order to see these compact chromosomes under a microscope, the chromosomes have to be out of the white blood cells. This is done by treating the white blood cells with a salt solution that causes them to burst. The sixth step is staining the chromosomes. Chromosomes are naturally colorless. In order to tell one chromosome from another, a special dye called Gyamsa dye is applied to the slide. The final step is cutting and arrangement. Once chromosomes are stained, the slide is put under the microscope for analysis. A picture is then taken of the chromosomes. By the end of the analysis, the total number of chromosomes will be determined and the chromosomes arranged.